Hey guys, so this is the first of this kind of video that I've ever done before, but um, I thought it would be a good idea to start with this particular set of figures that I have here. Uh, I just got these in, actually, or rather I just got the clothes in, which I had commissioned from a company called G Wiz Customs out of the Philippines. As you can see, this is Leon S. Kennedy from Resident Evil. Specifically, it's Leon from Resident Evil 6 here on the right, your right, and Leon from Resident Evil Vendetta, which is a CGI animated film they did a few years ago. Um, so I just thought I'd do a little review here of these figures. I don't really want to move them around too much or do any kind of articulation, uh, just because, as you might be able to tell, from the video, these clothes are quite expensive and are made of real leather. The jackets and the uh, vest over here and the holster are real leather, so I don't want to put too much stress on them as they obviously will be more fragile than your typical 1 6 scale figure clothing. Uh, this holster on, the one from Vendetta, is also real leather. Uh, anyway, so yeah, these are all handmade, hand sewn. As you can see the detail is very fine. Real zippers here, which are pretty cool. They actually zip up and down like a real jacket. So um and then all these little buttons here on the holster I think are all I think they're glued on but you can only get so much detail with the uh figure this small. But as you can see, the racing stripes on Leon's jacket here are sewn on. They're not painted. So you can actually see, like, the way they raise up a little bit here off of the uh, sleeve. Anyway, the uh, stitching is very fine. It's pretty amazing. I was very impressed when I opened the package up and saw this. I was like, couldn't believe the level of detail involved. So, if you're interested in these, in this particular set, or either of these particular sets, you can get them from G Wiz Customs. You can find them on the internet. Just type in G Wiz Customs uh, into the uh, Google search bar. Uh, I have Leon holding a uh, die-cast metal Desert Eagle, which he had in the movie here. And then, these boots that he's wearing. I just uh, found them off of eBay. I'm not sure uh, what figure they're from or what company makes them, but uh, I thought that they matched the shoes he actually has in the movie fairly well. So that's what I went with. And then the head sculpt is obviously just the uh, Hot Toys head sculpt from their Resident Evil 6 Leon figure uh, that they did a few years ago. So, uh, underneath his jacket, as you can see, he's got a, his blue shirt. That was also done by the G-Wiz, uh, also handmade. So, great details. Even his, uh, pockets here have real zippers in them. Although I don't think you can open them or close them. But why would you want to, right? Uh, and then the, the figure over here is Leon's outfit from Re Resident Evil 6, his China outfit. And again, it's all real leather. The tactical vest and the shoulder holster. And then the pants and the uh, leg holsters here are also real leather. The pants aren't leather, but just like on this figure, they were handmade. And the shirt is also handmade by G Wiz Customs. And you can see the detail also from the hand done stitching. They also made the belt and the um, ammo pouches. And then again, the shoes are just shoes I found on eBay, which I think look fairly close to the shoes he had in the game. Again, I don't know the company that makes them or like if they came from some other figure, but it's fairly easy to find.
close matching shoes and things like that on eBay. And then uh, he's also got a Desert Eagle in his shoulder holster here. And his two guns from the game. One he's got in his leg holster and the other one I have him holding. And these are just from the uh, Hot Toys. Leon, Resident Evil 6 figure. So, and then again, the head sculpt is the same from the uh, Hot Toys. So anyway, I just thought I'd give a quick little overview of these. And um, if you're interested in having your own figures like this, you can get them from VWiz. Uh, they are expensive though, I won't lie. So you'd have to be willing to spend a fair amount of money just on the clothes. Uh, and then the rest of it, like the body and the head sculpt, you'd have to acquire on your own. But, um, yeah, so there it is. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I wasn't too amateurish. And uh, maybe if you guys like it, I'll make more in the future. Thanks again. Bye.